All right, we're going to count in base 5 on this video. Here's a 1, and a 2 base 5, and a 3 base 5, and a 4 base 5. And then there's another one. Is there a 5 in base 5? No, there's not a 5 in base 5. So what do we need to do? We need to bundle them up and make those five ones into one bundle of five and move it over to the next place value chart. And then you see one there, but some people like to have a placeholder to let them know that that's just one so they don't write the number wrong. So they put a rubber band there just to hold the place so it even looks like a one zero. This is one zero base five when we have five pencils in base 10. Okay, we're gonna keep going. So now we have 1, 1, base 5, 1, 2, base 5, 1, 3, base 5, 1, 4, base 5. And then what, what do we do next? We bundle, right? Because you can't have five of any one thing. This bundling technique is a great way to teach beginning. And so now we have two bundles and nothing, two bundles of five and nothing in the ones place or to zero base five. So we're gonna keep going and we'll go a little faster now since you're getting it. Two one, two two, two three, two four. What's next? When the fifth one goes down, it doesn't go there. It gets bundled up with a rubber band and placed over in the fives because now it's a five. So now we have three bundles of five and how many ones? Zero ones. Okay, keep going. Three, one, three, two, three, 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 four. And then once we get the fifth one there, again, we bundle. So now we had, we had three bundles of five and we're about to have four bundles of five. So we're getting quite full over here, but we're at four, zero. Let's see what happens next. 4, 1, 4, 2, 4, 3, 4, 4, and then the fifth one comes, and we've got to bundle that, because you've got to bundle anything that has 5 in it and move it over to the next place value. But now we have 5 bundles of 5. So with our 5 bundles of 5, we need to bundle that and move it over, so that now we have five bundles of five. So five to the second is our 25. That's the place value we're in. So that's a one, zero, zero, base five. We have one bundle of 25, zero bundles of five, and zero singles. We'll go a little higher and then we'll stop. It's pretty clear from here that once we get five of these, which will not fit on our place value chart, that that huge, huge bundle of five would come over here as a 125. Yes, there we go. <laughs> the box may well be very close to that. So, all right, let's um, just count a little bit more. If we have one more, the equivalent of base 1026, we have 125, no fives, and one single. So that's a 101. Let's not make any place value errors. And then we keep going, one, 101, 102, 103, 104. And then once we get to the equivalent of 30 in base 10, it's really another bundle of five. It comes over and we have one, one, zero, base five. So that's the basics of counting with bundling in base five. The next video will do something else. Thanks for watching.